Today we're going to install this Amazon Smart Thermostat. We're going to use the tool that they give you, and with any luck, a Dewalt. So let's get started. Before you start, always kill power at the breaker if you can. Verify that the power is off. If your display is still on, that's probably because it's battery powered. Now take the handy dandy little screwdriver they give you, but make sure the color of your wires match up with the code on the bottom. You can see that I have a blue wire in the yellow spot. Make sure to take a picture of this so that you can match up the right wires with the right codes later on. After you loosen the screws, go ahead and pop the wires out. Now take off your faceplate. Sure, you could use that little dinky screwdriver they give you, but you know me. Any chance to use the power tool and I'll take it. Now go ahead and take your cover plate off. Before I hook up the wires, I like to mark my holes where I'm going to drill into. I had to move this home plate as much to the right as I could so that I can fit my face plate on at the very end. I didn't like where any of these previous holes were, so I just drilled my own. Now stick your little wires in there and start matching up colors with colors. I'm sure you remember that my blue wire actually goes into the yellow spot. These wires need to be pretty straight to get in there, so you may need to use something like pliers to straighten them out. I love this model because you just push these little levers on the right or the left and press in your wires. Speaking of this model, if you are going to buy this, if you click the link in my description below, I'll make about $4 at no extra cost to you, and I'll reinvest that back in the channel to make better videos for you guys. If your house has a fifth wire, you need to put it in the C spot. I only have four wires, so I needed a C wire adapter. This adapter takes the four wires that I have and turns it into five wires or adds a C wire. If you do use the C wire adapter, you're going to have to wire your thermostat like this. I found out the hard way, but we'll just keep going. I have plaster walls, so I had to add these little wall anchors. There's no need to ever get these very tight. All they do is hold this little light thing to the wall. Now it's time to turn your breaker back on and get your flames flying. If you want to learn another skill, but you only have about two minutes, I have a whole playlist dedicated to two minute tutorials. That playlist is in the bottom right hand corner of your screen and also in the description box below.